Hi everyone. The topic for this video is Twilio Authy Breach, which exposed millions of phone numbers. Starting with what is Twilio? Twilio is an American cloud communication company which provides communication tools for making and receiving phone calls, sending and receiving text messages, and a service to receive two factor authentication codes. It was reported that the threat hunter known as Shiny Hunter disclosed an unauthorized access to an unauthenticated endpoint within the Authy app. The data compiled by feeding a large list of phone numbers into the unsecured API endpoint. If the number was valid, it returned information associated to the account register inside the Authy. Authy is the app for multi factor authentication. The data retrieved included user account IDs, phone numbers, account status, the device counts due to an unauthorized endpoint into the RT, which led to the exposure of 33.4 million phone numbers. So now what was Trello's response and what were the mitigation efforts? Trello secured the endpoint uh, for preventing it from being misused in the future. Clarifying that, the breach did not extend to Twilio's core service or sensitive data. It was only limited to the specific endpoint, the specific API which returned the data if the phone number existed in their databases. The users were also recommended to update their applications to the latest versions as a preventive measure and a precautionary measure, both Android and iOS. So what impact it had on the users? Twilio advises users to remain vigilant because when their phone numbers have been exposed, they can be a victim of phishing and phishing attacks. Also, Authy also declared that there is no communication done by our end to the users to share their personal details or their credit card details. So the user should be cautious when communicating with someone who pretends to be with Authy or from Twilio. There have been similar breaches due to unsecure APIs. Here is a list of them. Mercedes-Benz API leak, which exposed vehicle location, customer identification, and maintenance details. National public data breach. 2.7 million records, including personal data, such as names, social security numbers, and physical addresses. Facebook API leak. User personal data, such as email addresses and phone numbers, were exposed. Optus API breach in 2023 exposed 9.5 8 million customers personal details such as their passport numbers driving license numbers and medicare numbers the t-mobile breach now t-mobile has been a victim of many breaches in the near in the near past one of them was in 2023 which exposed 37 million customer records inclu including their names addresses emails phone numbers and date of birth here is a list of references which you can refer to for validating the things or the stars mentioned or to gain an additional insight of the attack. Thank you.